on my people with your boy Z Gaming. I'm back for another video on the Walking Dead Road to Survival. And guys, in this video, I'm going to go over the quick solo Survival Road tourney. I know I didn't go over the other tourneys, guys. I do apologize. Um, with the holiday season still around, you know, it's finally, well, not over, but it's slowing down. So um, I'll start getting back to the videos a lot more often. Um, like I said, I do apologize about that. Um, as far as the um, survival road tourney for the faction, I think we got number two, so I did get enough gold nuggets, which by the way, um, Scopely kind of, um, this was kind of crazy how they did it with this, um, you only had a certain amount of time to claim these nuggets because I don't believe this tourney gives them at all, no it does not, um, even for the completion rewards, nope, so yeah, um, it was like really, really late when you had to claim them, so... Um, yeah, it is what it is, but I did go ahead and claim it. I had enough to get that last gear crate, so that's cool. I'm going to go ahead and open that here in a second. I um, also got that armory pool, so let me go ahead and go over the survival road tourney first. As far as the completion rewards, they're not bad. The bronze is okay. The legendary, you get a five-star trainer. Um, and then again, like I said, I wish they were um, gear bags or, or not, excuse me, not gear bags, food bags or trainer bags, maybe. You know, I could see maybe a trainer bag at Elite or something like that. That would be nice. As far as the rewards go, um, you know, the Universal Trainers are nice. Um, the This is okay if you do need the gear, but like I said, in newer regions, I can understand you may need this more. But in more veteran regions, um, it's all going to depend. You might not need it if you have a bunch of it stored up, but me personally, I do need some of it, so this is kind of cool for me. Um, and then the Military Watch and the Hand Crank Radio obviously isn't bad, so it's not a bad tourney. Um, it's not a great tourney, but it's not a bad tourney in my opinion. Let me know what you guys think of it in the comments below. Um, and let me know. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, by the way, guys, um, Happy New Year's um, to everybody out there. Um, I hope you guys have a happy um, New Year, like I said. If you guys have any new, um, new Year's resolutions or anything you'd like to accomplish this year, you know, feel free to share it in the comments below if you want to. Um, you don't have to. I was just um, throwing that out there if you want to. Um, that is a XP scavenger mission, so I'm not going to pull that right now. Um, so let's go ahead and do this armory pull, and then I will open that gear crate. So I went for huge AP bonus again on the Dwight's rifle. Hopefully I can get it, um, but I probably won't because Earl's not been giving me much luck here recently. Okay, it finally went critical, guys. Finally, I got it to go critical. Yes, okay, now all I got to add to this weapon is attack, and um, really, if I don't get 40% attack, I'm okay with it. Even if I um, don't get critical both times, that's fine. I just, I wanted that huge AP bonus for my Dwight, so I got it finally after like five attempts. So that's cool. So that's a good start, guys. Now, as far as this gear crate, what I really want to get is I want that, um, I believe, where is it? Yeah, I want another canteen. If I could pull another canteen, this would be very, very ideal. Um, because then I would have two of each, and that would be two six stars. I can eventually tier four here soon. Um, like I said, I got Wyatt as well. Um, so, you know, I didn't I didn't do too bad. I got Wyatt in those four gear crates, which is nice. So let's go ahead and open this. Hopefully I can get a canteen, but if I get a GPS, it's cool still. You know, I still got at least one um, of each, so that's fine. So come on, give me a canteen, and I got a GPS, so that's fine. You know, it is what it is. Um, I got a bunch of these food bags saved, too, for a level up. Um, but yeah, let me know how you guys did with the Gold Nugget event. Um, you know, like I said, I turned in the, um, where is it at? I got the Ascendable Recruit and the Legendary Gear. So that was that to me was worth it. You know, the hockey mask and stuff. I would have took it if I'd have got the Nuggets. But you know, like I said, um, the tournaments were all over the place, especially with the holiday season and stuff. But um, there it is, guys. You know, going over the um, thing, which by the way, um, Erica's back um, as well. She's still around. You can still pull for her. Um, I've been seeing a lot of people single pulling the six star, so you know who knows. If you want to um, try your luck, she's still a pretty good six star. Um, she's definitely one of the better ones for defense right now in the game um, because she's the only six star revive, I believe, at the moment. Um, but yeah, I'm almost finished with this too, guys. I broke down the six stars very well. I'm going to go over this more in depth here soon. Um, I'm breaking down the range and the melee into two videos, so stay tuned for that if you guys want my um, opinion on who to pull for and who I wouldn't bother pulling for. Um, and I'll give you an overall rundown of the weapon I would build for them for offense and defense. And yeah, guys, with all that really being said, you know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe. If you want a possible shout-out, drop it in the comments or message me over line. My line ID is in the description of every video. Thank you guys again for all the support. If you want to join the Discord chat as well, there's a lot of people starting to come in there now. Um, 
and I'm starting to figure out how to do it. So the link to that is also in the description if you guys want to join that. Um, yeah, if you also need help, any help, excuse me, if you need any help team building, etc., feel free to shoot me a message online, or if you just want to comment below and say hi, that's fine as well. And yeah, guys, also, if you want to make me an offense, the link is in the description as well to my latest roster reveal. Just click on the link, comment on offense, and I'll use it in the video and give you a shout out for it. Um, and yeah, guys, that's it again. Um, also, just real quick again, you know, Happy New Year again. And um, yeah, guys, also, if you've pulled any good pulls recently, feel free to share it in the comments below. I'm always interested to hear what you guys have pulled. And with all that really being said, guys, this is your boy Z Gaming. Peace.